today I'm going to give you an encouraging word for your Friday. I hope it builds you up and definitely does not tear you down, so stay tuned. Okay, so today I'm thinking about a topic that was discussed at our Bible study last night. Our pastor shared with us the story of Noah and the ark. And honestly, a thought occurred to me that he had brought up that I had never really entertained this thought before. And what he said was that when Noah got off of the ark, he had nothing but the animals that were in the ark and his family. He didn't have big fancy cars. He didn't have all these materialistic things, the top of the line iPhone. He didn't have state of the art, name brand clothing, Gucci and all these different things. He didn't have anything like that. What he had was the people in his life and those animals. But do you wanna know what he did? He didn't get upset because he had a disconnect notice. He didn't get upset because he was longing to find his soulmate and hadn't found it yet. He didn't get upset because his car had been repossessed or that he couldn't buy his kids the absolute state-of-the-art Christmas presents. He was not just sad and depressed and down, but he was thankful for the things that he did have. And the very first thing he did, he had no vineyards, he had nothing. The very first thing that he did was build an altar and make a sacrifice, which he was called to do in that time. And it was a pleasing aroma unto the Lord. What he did was give thanks in the midst of his circumstance. So what I want to share with you today is when you have nothing at all, give thanks because we can always give thanks. We can always have a grateful heart. We can always be humble and thankful and we can always build on an altar of repentance and give what we have, which is our life, back to Jesus Christ as a living sacrifice for him. And he deserves that today, guys. So today, what I want to share with you and what I'm so encouraged and what I'm so excited to share with you guys is give what you have. Give thanks. You have the ability to give God the number one thing that he wants above every single thing else, which is your heart, your mind, your soul, your body, and your strength. Give that unto him. Love him with all those things. Be a Christian. Tell someone about the gospel of Jesus Christ. Do something for another person. In this season, we're thinking of giving. In this season, we're thinking of paying it forward. We're thinking of the birth of Jesus Christ. We're thinking of the wise men coming in and giving him those gifts. And sure, materialistic gifts are nice, but this is the bottom line. Give to God like Noah did when he had nothing, when he was seemingly down and out and the world was completely without everything all he had was his family and those animals so no matter what season of life this video finds you in whether you watch this video in december of 2016 whether you don't see this video for five years from now be encouraged to know that you have what god wants it's you and only you can give you to him you have free will, so it's your choice. So be built up on this Friday. Be encouraged to know that you have more than enough to give. You are good enough. So give it you, the masterpiece, the wonderfulness of you back to the Lord. I hope this video finds you well. I hope it encourages you. I pray that you will comment in the comment section below how you guys are doing. What Christmas plans are you doing? Comment down below and let us know. We would love to know. And... I hope that you guys are truly, truly excited because the birth of Jesus Christ and that celebration is happening all around about us. Whether you celebrate Christmas, whether you do not, whether you celebrate Hanukkah, whether you do not, whatever it is that you celebrate or do not, regardless, the world knows the birth of Jesus Christ and the celebration of Christmas. He is the reason for the season. So I hope this video finds you well. Comment in the comment section below one thing that you are doing in this Christmas season and let's build one another up, not tear one another down. I hope you guys have a fantastic Friday and a super blessed weekend. Give this video a thumbs up. Share it with someone who needs a word of encouragement, who is down, who is low, who feels like they're at rock bottom and they have nothing and encourage them to know that they have everything that God wants for them and it's up to them whether or not they give it back. So have a blessed weekend guys and remember to stay kingdom minded.